It's painful. We don't have hospitals. We don't have schools. Nothing is working in the country. And all of us, everybody is just clamoring 2019, 2019. What is 2019? Are we sure that we are going to reach 2019? It's so bad. It's so bad. Things are happening. Leaders, you have to beg them to go and see what is happening in other uh, places. You have to beg them. Media have to use a lot of uh, noise before leaders can start moving to go to places and see what is happening. What kind of a country is this? What, what lesson are we giving for people that are coming up? What are we going to leave for our younger generation? Today, as a senator, as a senator of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, you get frustrated to place of somebody that has no job, somebody that has no, even his voice, nobody will even hear it. As a senator of the Federal Republic, you are seeing things going wrong. The other time, you can see, uh, if, if, uh, last week, you can, you can see, they wanted to, to kill my brother, Senator Dino Malaye. They took him to court. Is this is it not a standard in everywhere in the world that if some people maybe commit crime or attempted to assassinate you, police anywhere in the world they will ask you, do you have somebody you are suspecting, or do you have any argument with them? It's standard. Even in, 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 in US they do it. And you are coming to take somebody to court and say he fabricated as he lied against somebody. And this is the person that before that time he said that he would make sure that you know false. Is it not a good uh, something for him to tell the police? And now they took him to the court granted him death. And some people came in search him from. They want to take him and go actually. Everybody is denying, police is denying that they are not the ones that sent him. Everybody is denying. Which kind of country? He, that day, they, if they were able to arrest him by now, it would have been another story. They will say they are Boko Haram, or somebody will say they are not even security men. And nobody is coming to say, let us investigate who are those people. They came to uh, 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 kidnap him. It's left for all of us. This is a lesson for all of us. This country belongs to all of us. This issue of uh, 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 tri tribalism that we are doing, tribe, what, what we mean, language. Language is just a means of communication. Let us look at, uh, look at, let's look at ourselves as equal and the same. Somebody in Nigeria became a senator now in Italy. In Italy! He's a senator now, a Nigerian. And here in Nigeria, we are looking at religion. Is it not a, a, a personal thing between me and God? Did anybody go to grave and send messages to us that the grave or the heaven is, uh, is good? Nobody went there and sent messages to us or call us on phone or tell us what is there. It is something that is personal. Whether you are a Christian or you are a Muslim, it's something personal between you and God. That should not disturb anybody. Let anybody practice what he wants. Are you going to tell me the whole of more than 70% of Asia are going to hell? Because they are not practicing Islam. They are not practicing even the Christianity in Asia. When you go to China, if you tell them you are a Christian, you are this is your business. So are you going to tell me the entire uh, uh, Chinese they are going to hell? Over one billion people, are you telling me that? Or is there any pastor or imam in this country that will tell me that he's going to heaven? They will tell you that um, I swear with Quran or Bible that if I die, I'm going to heaven. Is there anyone? Nobody. So it is what you do. And this heaven is favor from God. It is what is in your mind that God will judge you. No matter how you are, if you are a man, if you, are, if you have a wicked mind, if you are a sadist, if you are wicked, you cannot make it. A lot of our people in this, this Nigeria, we are not even practicing the religion. There is ten commandments in the Bible, and that ten commandments is there in the Quran. Who are who? How many people do we have that are following these ten commandments? How many people do we have? So, issue of position, we, we we make noise about religion, or we make noise about tribe, and we don't even practice it. Call language is just a means of communication. Today, if you are an Igbo man, if I if I will speak with you in English and you understand me, we are in the same level. I can, I, I can decide today as a house man to go and learn your word, to go and learn people, and I'm speaking. We have so many people like Naala can speak people fluently. We have them. So it's, it's just a means of communication the way we are speaking English. So this is why people will tell us that, okay, today we should stop speaking English because they are the ones that is their own language. 
<coughs> it is high time. Let us do what we are going to do and move this country forward. Nigeria is backward. <coughs> Nigeria is not moving. It is only in theory that they will fabricate papers and tell you that they are GDP, all these things. In practical, we are not going anywhere. So it is there for us now. All this sensation about 2019, let us see what we are going to do. Let us see who will move this country forward. Uh, thank you so much, uh, uh, Moses.